Well, hello there, people. Long time no see. So, today was very interesting, guys. As some of you may know, back in December, our camera broke. Our beautiful, high-quality HD camera broke. And since then, we have not been able to make any videos. Um, but all that has changed. Did we get a new camera? No, as you can tell by the quality here. Um, but I figured if YouTube can change all their settings to all their videos and comments to make it look like crap, I can surely post a video that is slightly less than good. It has inspired me to have the video start up again. Over the past couple of months, a lot has changed. Um, as you know, Nathan had started uh, VPK, and that left me at home with Sean. But, um, for those of you who don't know, I broke my ankle in January. As a matter of fact, I broke it on New Year's Eve. Um, so, really December. And that meant the next couple of months would have consisted of me keeping my foot in an elevated position. Um, not real fun to watch on video, so maybe it is uh, a serendipitous event that my camera broke at the same time because that would have not been entertaining um, but other than that uh, it was me and Sean and Nathan at school and Christina at work so not not many fun things happened that's not what this video is about this video is about kids and how kids grow up to be exactly like their parents. Now for me, that may just mean physically, for if you've seen my children, you know they have both my hairline and my slightly emasculate features. Okay, so here's the story of this morning. Um, we woke up, we're getting ready to go to, to preschool, and um, Sean and Nathan are eating. I just got them breakfast, Nathan is still in his pajamas, and I said, hey buddy, we need to get dressed. Why don't you go pick out something to wear? Well, he tells me, why don't you pick it out? So I think to myself, hey, I've been in this situation before with your mother and I've learned my lesson because I've only got a 50-50 shot of getting it right and I never do. Um, so I, I, I said, hey, he's more like me than he is like her. So maybe, maybe we like the same things. So, so here are my boys two options. Iron Man, which is a short sleeve shirt, and uh, the motocross motorbike shirt that is a long sleeve shirt. Well, somewhat long sleeve, more like a capri if it was on your legs. And so I brought both items before my child and asked him which one he would prefer, to which he decided he wanted the motocross shirt. And I said to him, are you sure that you want the long sleeve shirt and not the short sleeve shirt? No, he said he wanted the long sleeve shirt. We went to school, he gets home today for lunch. I make them lunch, I leave the room, I come back, Nathan's in a different shirt. And I said, where did your shirt go, buddy? His response is what this video is about. His response was, it was a hot day and you just gave me a long sleeve shirt. I was baffled because my memory, which is keen, by the way, told me that I did not pick him a long sleeve shirt. I gave him the option to choose. Well, this is where my son shows the personality of my wife. His response was, well, you should have just not let me do that. He effectively told me that even though he was wrong, I was wrong. Er. Have you ever been in that situation? Do you know someone like that? Now I know two people like that. And I'm related to both of them. All right, guys. It was good talking to you. See you next time.